Hey guys, Max here from ShopSolarKits.com. Today's video is a quick overview of the cables that come with your Blue Eddy here. I'm gonna show you how to use them so you can make sense of them uh, and take advantage of your power station here. First thing we're gonna cover is the power brick itself. This goes into the side of the generator. I'll show you where to plug that into in a second. And here's the other end that goes into the, your, this goes into the power brick, this goes into the wall or another gas generator, uh, something like this, and you can plug plug this into the wall, an AC power source, plug this into your generator, and you're good to go. So the first cable to start with is this one. This seems to cause people the most issues. At the end of the video, you're gonna see how to connect this cable into the side of your generator, um, but this is the first cable here that is going to allow you to connect to the other cables that come with your generator. So this one will plug into the side and then the XT90 connector will allow you to get your solar panels into it. What you do is you go XT90 to XT90. Now this cable, the other end are MC4 adapters. These MC4 adapters, if you get a kit from us, are what's gonna plug into the solar extension cable that comes with your kit. This is how you get solar panels to connect into your generator. Similarly, this cable, you'll plug it into your generator and then this end here, you can plug into the other XT90 connector. And now this will go into the cigarette adapter of your car, for example. And now you're able to plug this into the car, this into your, into your generator, and then you're able to charge your generator while you're driving. So that is how all these cables work together. This is the most important one to know. This goes into the generator, and then you're able to use both of the other cables. Here's the end of the wall charger. This goes into this side of your generator. You plug it in and the other end goes into your standard household plug or the plug of a gas generator. Depending on the generator that you have, there will be a white dot or a red dot right on the top of this outlet. On the top of this plug, there will be a white or a red dot as well. All you need to do is line up this red dot or white dot with the white or red dot on the top and that's how you connect them together. You will pull this part back, plug it in. You will feel that that is tight now. That is in and that's not going anywhere. The other end of that plug is the XT90 connector and this is what you use to plug into either the MC4 adapter or the car adapter.